I'm dying. What? Are we like back to the car vlogs? Yeah, baby. Woo! Y'all, I am excited. How is this real? <laughs> I'm low key excited. I bought this yesterday and I was like, we're doing a vlog tomorrow. Let's go. And it's Friday. Perfect fitting to do this. Oh, I hate this time of day. The sun is like bursting out and I cannot see for the life of me. Hopefully it's not super bumpy. I still have to fix it a little bit, but I'm rushing. It's 7.35 and I have to go. Only thing is, this camera is so big that it's very noticeable. Like across, if someone's walking, like driving against me, they're so gonna see the camera because it's so cute. Anyways, hello guys. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. I'm so excited to be doing these car jumps. get a little like she gotta go a little better but i'm gonna go to starbucks welcome back to another weekend in my life vlog honestly i'm just doing today and tomorrow that's pretty much it i'm not doing a lot but i'm excited i'll talk a little bit more soon hopefully this will be a little bit better i'm not gonna do car jams right now only because i am rushing to work i just have like videos in the background so i'm gonna go to starbucks I'm gonna see how long this contraption lasts because I don't have it glued yet to my the top of the car. I don't know how you freaking call that. It's gonna get a grande frap, um, grande chai latte because I might have an afternoon pick me up but not from Starbucks. I'm gonna make myself something at home. Sorry, I forgot to say guys. If you're new here, my name is Daya. I do lifestyle vlogs, all kinds of beautiful vlogs. I love to vlog for you guys and for myself. It's really beautiful memories that I get to make. Like, subscribe, follow me on all my socials. Let's go to Starbucks. <laughs> now let's go to Starbucks. I'm in tears. Almost in tears right now. It is 8.40 in the morning and I'm trying to take this shit off. Cause this day couldn't get any worse. I was trying to take this shit out and I just broke this whole thing. Carly's gonna kill me. Look at this. Oh, he's gonna kill me. My husband's gonna kill me, y'all. <laughs> I can't, I can't. I'm so mad. Look at this, we got a whole decotega. I'm kidding, it's just because of the Grinch that I'm watching in the background. It's been a minute since I last talked to you guys and I think I was gonna talk to you guys tomorrow because after this morning, what happened to me with my car and then at work, like I had so much work. This whole week has been really, really busy for me. I was like, done i called hubby and this afternoon i waited all day to call him i was like oh my god he's gonna be so mad you know men usually get like mad whenever girls like you know like go over a bump or like, scratch the rims you know any any little shit that has to do with the car i feel like they get mad like i'm just gonna i'm gonna calm myself down all day when i get home i'll tell him i called him and i think he saw that i was mad at myself and he didn't even get mad he was like it's okay just look for the piece and just buy it it's okay i'll fix it so bless his freaking soul i love this men guys i have the best husband ever ever i was like bless you because i really didn't need like on top of that for him to get mad at me after this whole day today but he knows i've had a rough week so i think he knew on top of that like i don't even know how i haven't cried at all this week my 
my period is coming next week so i'm probably pmsing and that's probably why i'm feeling a little overly stressed i've just had a very chaotic week very very chaotic week i was like look i'm gonna go home i'm gonna snuggle myself eat and watch the grinch what better than to watch a christmas movie it always makes you feel better i started to feel better and then i was like i want to grab my camera and talk to my people and just do my own thing and i was so excited to grab my camera because I missed you guys. I, I just wanted to talk here. I was so excited to start this vlog with my car jams. And like, there goes my fucking car jams. Because I cannot. No, I can definitely not do car jams, guys. Not like at least for a while. And I was so fun because I was like, oh my god. We're going to do like a few. Like we're going to jam to a whole bunch of songs this weekend. You know, while I'm driving. I still have the car mount. But I don't know. I could probably maybe put it in my window. And just avoid cracking anything else. But this camera is heavy. And I feel like the car mount is too shitty for this camera because this camera is high quality it's like heavy heavy duty so i'm cooking i wish you guys can smell my, my kitchen because it smells so good i'm making some beef and i'm gonna make some wraps with beef lettuce you know stuff like that for tomorrow's lunch and then i guess tomorrow i can tell you guys what i'm doing as i'm getting ready tomorrow i'm excited i am about to finish the reading vlog i've been doing for like a month i knew i was gonna dread it by the end of the vlog like the, how long i let it go through i should have just done three books instead of four the book that i just read which by the way i have to give you guys a little tour of my new case of my kindle we'll get to it in a minute i promise guys I read this book and I think it's been my lowest fucking rate ever called faking Christmas you guys have to watch my reading vlog and if you haven't watched it yet go back and watch it so you guys can see why I rated it two stars because I'm not gonna say it here so here's the books that I have next I have one specific fall book actually it's by Morgan Elizabeth which I'm really excited yes it's the same author that wrote Tis the season for revenge it's called the fall of Bradley Reed that's how it's called it's apparently like Grumpy Sunshine Revenge Romance and it's in the fall season apparently so it's right up my alley then I also have this random book I found by Stephanie Archer it's called Behind the Net I don't know why it reminds me of Icebreaker as an option as well I might honestly move towards Morgan Elizabeth's book because I know I'm, I love her book so I don't know we'll see or I might just buy a book in my kindle and just read one that i think that i'm gonna like now that i decorated my kindle which we're gonna talk about that now i know i kind of i kind of want to read in here so i think i'm just gonna see what book i find in here maybe my kindle is under or something freaking adorable this cover i found these stickers from amazon if you guys want i can link the whole thing down below the pop socket the, the case is a f pure fiasco i have to talk about this because i ordered a case that's way bigger and i gotta return it i also have a few returns to do this weekend now that i think about it from amazon it's very y2k i'm obsessed with this whole stickers and i ain't gonna lie i i caved and i ordered a whole collection of book stickers like 10 ish i think it was i found them on etsy and then i bought like a book a kindle case thingy like a card it's something that you like put right here and then you put the case on top of it that's my new case as much as i love the other one i i, I do want to spice it up and this is a genius idea because you can spice it up and exchange the stickers all the time i just literally searched y2k on amazon and i found all these like a whole collection of these for like two bucks so anyways i'm gonna shower we're gonna restart our day tomorrow hopefully tomorrow will be much better and hopefully i'll be able to just detach of you know of work i will talk to you guys tomorrow since valentine's day it hasn't deflated which i'm really shocked it's the next day and I'm feeling much better mentally i'm gonna get ready i'm gonna run some errands I'm gonna lie it's 8 a.m so i was able to get some sleep which is what i needed i was like if i don't get sleep this weekend we're gonna have a rough week next week because i feel like usually when hubby's working i get all kinds of content shit done so here i am waking up at 8 in the morning had a nice eight hour sleep I actually woke up at 7 30. your girl found a cabral in one of my makeup bags and i think it was the makeup bag i packed for my new york trip Today, we're running a few errands. 
I'm gonna go to Walmart, Target, and possibly Publix. It's gonna go to a whole new supermarket and do like a whole vlog here. There's a local Sprouts that I have recently, but I think I'm gonna leave it for next weekend and do a full grocery shopping there. I know it might be a little bit expensive. They say it's, it's like a Publix technically, but apparently they have a lot of more healthier stuff, you know, than Walmart. And I've just been, I ain't gonna lie, I've been wanting to switch up my, my meals and do a little bit more of healthier meals. So, or like using healthier things with the same meals I make, you know. Now all my seasonings are either organic or they have like some sort of healthy stuff stuff on it. I haven't used this in a minute. We're gonna use them today because why not? The concealer from ColourPop but obviously I used the darker shade for it. Bouncing. But I used to love this so much. I want to see if I can go to Target. I've been seeing these like fluffy pumpkins. They're like huge and they put them on their bed. And I thought it was a cute thing and I want it so bad. And I think I saw, I did see it when we went to the Super Target. Did I get it? No. I told myself I would go back and check it out. But I don't know if they have it on my local Target. And then Publix. I did see this girl on TikTok trying the pumpkin cream cold foam at home. And I want to get the ingredients and i believe she uses chobani creamer i know that the creamers from chobani they sell them at publix i don't think they sell them at target so i told myself i would go and maybe try it out and see if it actually tastes like it i will keep you guys posted about it but i think i'll try it tomorrow but i'm not gonna vlog tomorrow i'm just gonna take that day off for myself you know what is wrong with my makeup today I feel like it looks blotchy i don't know i try and be productive at home and have a chill day as well but yeah those are the only places i have to go today so we shall see but it's lovely sun saturday am i wearing a sweater in the middle of technically summer because it's still summer in florida yes yes i am am i taking it off no no i'm not i'm gonna wait till my voice is much better so i can talk to you guys well, i ain't gonna lie i'm still really bummed that i can jam with you guys in my car jam but it's fine. Abby told me that I can put it on the crystal of my window, like my front window, that which is sometimes what a lot of vloggers do. They put it there and they put the camera upside down. I might try that. I don't know. We shall see. I'm just scared that it'll fall and it'll fall on the dash where I broke it. That's what I'm scared of. Because this camera is so heavy that I don't know if it's gonna hold off like the window. All right, makeup is done. I'm gonna put some liner on my lips. I'm doing the Milani understatement lip liner. This is in the shade Cafe Ule 160 but usually I just leave some lip balm on my lips and I just layer it with this and it just makes your lips look nice and buttery lips are done we're gonna head out the door because I'm literally done let's do a o o t t upside down right now y'all but this camera is so smart that it like flipped it around and it did a whole contraption hopefully people don't notice this shit too I figured I could do some car jams what should we listen to I'm up for like coastal grandma vibes yeah let's go with the coastal grandma vibes We 
like this angle. I think it looks cool. I think it just brings how good I drive. <laughs> sure. So I don't have any new music. I've just been into Taylor Swift. Sorry, but I'm a, I'm a Swifty. Any promises now can we be? <laughs> oh shit, I have to ship my mom's package. But I forgot about that. I'm gonna have to go back home. What time does the post office close? Stop. How do you forget about that? I literally put an alarm from 9 a.m. thinking I wasn't gonna be out of the house at 9 a.m. They close at 1. I'm gonna have to get all these errands done, go home, get the package, and then come back. And ship it for them. My sister also finished Icebreaker and she said she liked it. Yeah, she, I don't know how many stars she gave it, but she said she liked it. Let's head inside. I'm feeling much better. You can see that my mood has changed because this contraption, I think it's working. I'm gonna keep it right there, Zaz. I'm not even gonna take it out. I'm just gonna take the camera out and just hide it, obviously, to avoid anyone stealing it. the pillows and that's mainly what I was going for so I just got a chai latte instead in my Starbucks inside of Target. As I said, nothing on Target. They didn't have the pumpkins. I was a little bummed about that but if I'm being honest, maybe it was a sign that I shouldn't get it. My house has been decorated for fall for the past three weeks I would say and I ain't gonna lie, it doesn't feel like fall outside so I don't really feel like decorating anything more and I feel like moving on and going to Christmas, you know? I'm like, okay, Christmas time now. I'm crazy. First sip. Mmm. First sip always hits different. I love it. Should we jam to some more T Swift? I think that's what I'm only jamming to. So what I have is I just look for set list playlist from her tour because I still have FOMO and I just put that. So I'm gonna put you guys my all time favorite song, Senora. Did you see how she pulled up? I was like, whoa, calm down. We're gonna do Fearless and as much as I love her new version, I ain't gonna lie, I actually love her old one more because it has like the more happiness vibes, but obviously we gotta, it's my favorite one. I'm a Fearless girly. Walk me to the car, it's right there in the middle of the parking lot. or like a BB cream or something. And I'm thinking that this medium one should work. So this one, it's like a beauty balm. Sky on and on and now we gotta keep it up. Over 
over 100 bucks because of this item that I bought that cost me $80. Oh my god, but I needed it honestly for playing. So, because the one I have, it got damaged. But I'll give you guys a haul at home. I'm gonna go to Bath and Body Works actually and pick up a candle that I ordered. I ordered the famous, I think it's leaves or fall. Una or dos. They had a sale like two days ago. I don't know if they still have it. Let me actually check because if they do, they do. They still have it. The candles are $12.95. And I might honestly go in there and pick up mines and then pick up one more because i think i bought i think i bought leaves something fall i'm going to head over there album is so fall like it gives the fall vibe and i'm obsessed <laughs> i had to and the rest on your door i never needed anything more You guys know this is all the shit I got. It technically looks like a lot, but it's because I have Publix, Walmart, and I actually also have Dollar Tree because I went to Dollar Tree last minute because I was talking to my parents and mom and my aunt and they needed some plates and I got two plates. Really cute plates for the dining room just to like set them really cute. Publix first because after I went to Walmart, I forgot that I needed milk. I was close by to my local Publix, so I was like, I'm just gonna stop by and just get that. Of course, I didn't buy only milk. I remembered I wanted to try a few new creamers, so I got that. I have been wanting to try almond milk for the longest time, and if I'm being honest, I don't know why, but it just feels like I wouldn't like it, but honestly, it smells good. It doesn't even smell like bad at all. I'm gonna try it with my iced coffee during this week, see if I like it. So I got that. I absolutely love Chobani coffee creamer. This is the vanilla one. I'm obsessed with this flavor. And then you guys know I always buy this milk because it's really, really healthy and it's lactose free. It's got protein. Apparently it has less sugar. So two of those. The plates that I got in Dollar Tree. This is how they look. They're really beautiful. They were $1.25 and you just place them with other plates. I got some sweet plantains for cooking later tonight i also got the regular cooking banana make myself for lunch like some guinea with like a little salad or something you know something healthy 
side note, I love that we were able to do the car jams. That put me in a, such a better mood from yesterday. For the haul from Walmart, some green grapes. Got these for Charlie. Some Chips Ahoy. An onion. I got this brush. I've been needing a brush like this to use it for like, like spraying barbecue or sauces around your chicken. I don't know if it's this one. I think it is. I, I know that a lot of people use the plasticky one, but this one's like actual brush. Like the bristles are like actual brushes. So I'm gonna try it. I got some Sweden condensed milk because I'm gonna attempt tomorrow to make the pumpkin cream cold foam and that's one of the recipes. I got some potatoes. I got two of the balanced breaks. This I've been in search of a BB cream. I told you guys this in the video and gratefully this has SPF and sunscreen and I've just been wanting something that I can just apply quickly and just be on the go. I don't know if this is good. This is old. Like this actual product. It has SPF so I was like hey I'm sold. So I got it in the shade medium 120 but it's like a sheer tint so i think it should be fine i just thought that this would match me better than the light one the light one was like light pink and i was like no and while i was at it i actually got this concealer this is the superstay maybelline active wear concealer i don't think i've ever tried this i think i've tried the regular superstay matte finish love the packaging some chicken like pork loin pumpkin puree again for the recipe i'm trying this was what hurt me i'm gonna lie the fact that i made this purchase i was like i'm gonna have to because mines were completely broken and i think they're like one of the console like controllers are broken so i pulled the plug and i got new ones and i ain't gonna lie i thought these were way cheaper i thought these were like 30 or 40 bucks no honey these were like 80 bucks so i thought about it went through the aisles and everything and i was like fuck i'm so get one i got a different color i thought these were really cute like pastel last but not least i got some chicken breasts and some whipping cream i got a small one just in case i don't like the whole pumpkin cream cold foam doesn't taste like the one from starbucks unfortunately i am going to stop showing you guys the books i get for the book advent calendar because i decided to just surprise you guys instead when you guys open the book advent calendars with me when you guys see it so i will tell you guys i got one more book which means i have like eight or nine and i finally randomly found wrapping paper of christmas on dollar tree so i'm gonna show you guys what i got so it's like a christmas i think i've had this wrapping paper before but i just don't know where it is and this is huge it's like half my size it's like so long but i got this one it has like really cute santa sleighs and it's like neutral i was gonna get another one more but at least i can start wrapping some of the books with this one as well and it'll make it more christmasy let me show you guys what i got in back of so i got my famous flannel candle right this candle Every year I get either one or two and I'm not surprised if I go back and get one before the season leaves. But oh my god, what is this? Leaves and the white pumpkin one? I love those for fall. Finally got my hands on these. This was just $12.95. Had a rewards from the Bath & Body Works app because I've been buying a lot there lately. I bought the soaps and now I bought this. So I got this one for 50% off on top of the $12.95. Like what? So this one is the famous white pumpkin one as well. I usually get this one too and uh, the packaging. Look how beautiful that is. How neutral it looks and it matches with my decor. Anyways, I got home and I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna play for a while. Like three to four hours. I'm gonna play some Sims. I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna cook. And I'm gonna do a little bit of cooking with me. Update you guys a little bit later. Alright, it's been a few hours. I had some lunch. I literally had some, you know, el video with a little bit of a salad. It was a little bit of a healthy, you know, meal. But now I'm going to make myself a frappe as you can see on the background i need to pause for a second with this vlog and vlog my last clip for my reading vlog which you guys have probably seen it if not i will leave it in the i card for you guys but i'm gonna grab my kindle my books that i've been reading do a little bit of a wrap up got my little kindle three hours later cook some spaghetti that's gonna be our dinner with some sweet plantains make a little puerto rican style
I just showered, detached everything out of my face, makeup, did my skincare, skin is nice and glowy, and now I'm about to eat and call it a night with you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed. It's beautiful, nice, productive weekend in my life vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed my little mini mental breakdowns. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and turn the post notification bell on so you guys can be notified every time I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Yeah.